we're going to talk about this little leather bound journal I've got. It's really nice. It's got that really old school worn leather look. I kind of like it. Um, it's got this piece to hold it shut. This is a refillable journal. Right now I haven't put anything in it yet. It's got the little card holder and writing paper and unlined paper and more lined paper and then this little pouch on the end that you can put something in. Um, it's really simple. Let me get a better angle here. To change the bits out, all you got to do is just peel these little strings off and voila. You can get more paper to replace it. It also came with this little folder piece that is not in it at the moment, but you can put it in just like the paper by just sliding it on in there and now you have a folder in there and in fact you can actually put the paper in with the folder like so just again peel this up a little and slide it in it's easy to do a little awkward to try and keep on camera though and then you've got your journal all bound together this piece back here is just kind of sitting in loosely, but that's all right. It's just held in there by the pressure of the other stuff. So, yeah, it's really, I love this old school kind of worn leather look. It really looks like something you'd find up in your attic that your great, great, great grandparents were using way, way back in the day. It also comes with this little pen and this, which I am like 80% sure is to hold the pen. And the pen itself actually has leather wrapped around it and stitched on. That's a very simple stitching procedure for leather. Um, it's a very nice little pen. It's one of the twist kind, not one of the click kind. And it comes with this which to the best of my knowledge is just a little brass looking money clip. I'm sure there's other things you could do with it, but to me it just looks like a little brass money clip. So I like the whole look of it, you know, I really do. It doesn't smell very leathery, but it very looks, it looks very leathery, I should say. Um, these are the little strings holding it together. I suppose you could actually untie these if you wanted to, but I don't see the point. And one of the string pieces is what holds the whole setup into the book. It's really nice. Um, I would definitely recommend it if you need yourself a nice travel journal. Or if you want to make an old school looking journal for a project of some sort, this is a great one because it really does have that look of something old. And I like it. So, yeah. I like to have journals around so I can write stuff down and sketch out random stuff whenever I'm bored. And I really like the look of this one. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet because it just looks like it should have a special purpose. Because it's just, I really do love the way this thing looks. So, yeah.